Um, really, it's, you know, it's most of my group is majority seniors, so really just kind of the last time we play together as a group and just, you know, playing, just playing well, really. Can we play consistently? Um, you know, we haven't, State Cup was at the end of March, so we really have, haven't had any competitive games since. We've kind of had a couple friendlies here, um, you know, a couple of practice sessions. Um, so really, I'm just looking for that consistency. Can we be game fit? That's really the, my big issues. And I think as long as we're locked in and ready to go, I think, I mean, we got, we got a good squad. And now it's just a matter of can we put all those things together, you know, against, against some, you know, obviously some high level teams. And I think if we can do that, we'll have an exciting weekend. Um, it's been a lot of hard work, a whole lot of uh, practices that were uh, long days, but the team really came together and developed awesome over the entire season. So I'm excited. I think I think when we're when we're playing out when we're playing well and playing our best, I think I think you know we can beat anybody. The the talents there, um, I think, like I said, it's just a matter of kind of getting everybody back on the same page, everybody back in that you know that mid-season form again mentally. Um, I think you know once we we do that, I like you know I like I like our chances to be able to compete. I'm really looking forward just to traveling with my team one last time. This will be our last time all playing together, so. Really looking forward to that. You know, we want to represent the state well. We want to represent our club well. And I think you know, a lot of these girls, for the most part, are done after this year. You know, we, we have a handful going to play college, but the majority are done. So we want to make sure that you know, we, send, we send them out on a, you know, on a high note and you know, just let everybody know that you know, we, Baton Rouge Soccer Club has, has some good players and some good teams. And you know, we, we, want to, we want to prove that. Well, with the old sixes, they had to deal, our, our team uh, as well, like the whole six team had to deal with the deep reformulation as we lost like seven players from MLS Next. Also, we had five new players from a different club, and even myself as a, as a new head coach. So a lot of changes, but uh, still I believe the boys uh, did a good job understanding that was a new process and you know helping each other with, with all that. I think we're ready for it. There's good competition over there, you know. It's a high level, very high level. We just got to give it our all. First of all, it's been very hot here in Louisiana. One of the strategies we did it was just like try to train in the morning, try to acclimate with the weather. So we basically changed practice from 6.30, which is kind of like cool weather for like uh, 10 to 11.30, which is like super hot here. Try to adjust it with the, with the time that we're going to play. Them. Okay, with, uh, with the 08 teams, unfortunately, I won't be able to travel with the team as both competitions, they overlap each other. But I truly believe in Coach Malin. He's a great coach, a friend of mine that I, that I really believe he can lead the team. Also, he knows the players very well and the players appreciate his presence there. So I think they, the chemistry is going to be really good and they're going to do a great job there. It's been fun. Uh, I, I was anticipating, you know, joining in a, a good team and in a show and in training. So I think it's going to be uh, it's been fun and I'm sure it, he's prepared them pretty well so all I have to kind of do is kind of manage the training sessions and kind of make sure they're in shape when they when they play so uh, it's been it's been it's been a fun time so far at the we were starting off kind of shaky at the beginning of the season but as we progressed into like the fall season and to, into the spring season we've been doing a lot better especially with practice and with games it's my expectation is to be at least playing in the final. That's my expectation and then hopefully from there, once we get to that final, it's, you know, it's up to them what they want to do from there. Uh, and obviously hopefully I prepare them enough to where they can be successful and then hopefully be advancing to the next stage, in, uh, which is Nationals. I guess it kind of started last year in Louisiana President's Cup when we came in second. So I guess that just kind of started. Yeah, it started our motivation and our uh, want to really finish it out this year and get to that to get to regionals after coming so close last year. I guess we're looking forward to playing teams that we have never seen before because like usually when we go to either Louisiana tournaments or tournaments just in like Mississippi, Alabama just around us we usually come across the same teams a lot. Yeah so this will be a different experience to play teams of different levels that we don't typically see. All of them, it'll be their first time going. Um, you know, been a few years, and I think just the experience of one representing your state, the, the the grand scale of teams coming, you know, from all over to to compete and have the same goal. I think that's going to be exciting for them. So that's what I'm looking forward to the experience. I'm very uh, excited for our team, and I hope we can do good at regionals. Um, my first year with them, um, they've had tons of success in all their leagues. Um, you know, I think. They're, out of the many groups that I've had, 
just so close knit. They hang out. I mean, whether we're at soccer, they're hanging out um, off the field, on the field. They're just they're a fun group. Uh, but also, it's probably the most competitive team I've ever had. Uh, they don't want to lose nothing. I mean, they're getting pissy right here just because you know they might have lost a, one goal or missed a shot or whatever. So it's that's fun to be here. Last year we played up, but we didn't make it to regionals. So. We've been working on making it to regionals this season, and we did it. We've been making a lot of accomplishments. Uh, definitely one of the big things that I'm looking forward to is just the level of play. Being in Louisiana, getting exposure to some better teams is something that we mostly look forward to. Also looking forward to replaying a team that kind of got the upper hand of us in one of our bad games. I've, I've, I've seen a big improvement from my girls. Uh, started the year a little bit slow and started developing. Uh, I think the biggest thing is uh, the chemistry uh, of the girls, getting along with each other. Uh, they started getting better um, in the spring and we played all of our opponents and we always, uh, the games that we didn't win, we, we competed in every single game. Played National Pro League, girls did very well. Uh, played some really good soccer in California, so we ready. We've gotten way closer this season, which is really fun to be a part of, and it's helped us be stronger this season. Um, a lot of games we've played stronger, we've had less weak games. There's less games where we don't bond very well uh, than it was in previous seasons, just because we've gotten closer as a team, and so we play strong. We, those girls here, they're prepared to play anybody, anywhere, anytime, so. We're coming. Tell them we're coming for you. <laughs>